Hello and welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a great day today. And if you're not and you need it, here you go. Big man hug just for you. And today we're going to be looking at wiring a uh, foot switch for a pedal. So yes, I'm going to show you how I wire up a three pole double throw foot switch for effects pedals. Um, I hope it's informative enough for you because I found it was something I struggled with. Um, a lot of people do do them slightly differently, but this, I, I have slight memory issues, but I can remember this layout really well because it's dead simple. All right, um, so yeah. This is a shot on my GoPro. I am using uh, external mic, so hopefully it should be okay. Um, and also, if this is something that you're interested in, uh, please, you know, let me know. Show me that you, you enjoy these videos. Comment down below. Um, subscribe to the channel would be nice. And then, yeah, let's get into it. Um, and then I'll see you at the end. Okay, so we're gonna wire up a foot switch. Okay, this is a three pole double throw foot switch. Um, essentially, let me get my trusty uh, pointing stick. These three lugs, which are three, five, and seven, are always active. And depending on which way the switch is pressed, depends which outer poles are selected. Okay, so I used to do this a different way, but now I'm trying this way. And from for me, ugh, I've always had difficulty learning. Um, it, it makes more sense to do it this way. So essentially, we put our um, input jack on this side and our output jack on that side. We then put our board in there and our board out there, and then we link them two lugs there. This lug stays empty, and that lug is for our LED earth. So basically, when it's switched, um, obviously our earth then travels um, for our LED, which puts our LED on. As you can see, I've already got my uh, inputs and outputs. Um, luckily, I'm building an Acapulco Gold with a mod, gain mod, so our input is actually on the gain pot and our output is on the volume pot. So they're already wired in. And then all we've got to do is connect these up and then put our little link in. So I've already made my little link, which is there. Yeah. So we will start with that. Yeah. Just put our little link in. Ah, I'll drop it. Like so. Yeah. I'm just gonna bend that leg there just to keep it in place. Okay, now you can see that's a bit close to our earth leg, but I can earth lead, but I can just move that out of the way. Come on, you little beauty. Come on, mate, there we go. Oh fingers, that's probably all you're seeing right now. I was hoping this would be a bit quicker than any, especially the earth one. Damn. There we go. That's our link in. Okay. I'll just tin my soldering iron. I hate this solder. There's far too much flux in it for my liking. And there we go. It's one leg of the link. the other leg of my link. Yeah. Yeah, because of how I do my wiring, um, I, to, I use solid core and I've already pre um, bent this, but as you can see it's all all over the place. I'll um I'll neaten that up later. I've still got my soldering iron in my hand, he says trepidatiously and then put 
that one on. Might as well put my R on. Yeah. Let me put circuit input and our circuit output. Right. And then I'll just blitz some solder onto these. And that is essentially how we wire up our foot switch. Yeah, I'm just neaten up these cables real quick because it's really messing with my head. So there we go. So, like I was saying, this is our input side. So our signal is coming in. There, when the foot switch is in bypass mode, it's coming out. It's going through them two points. That, these six lugs are linked. Yeah, so them three are linked together. These three are linked together. There, boom, goes across, boom, in there. Now, output gives us true bypass. When the foot switch is engaged, yeah, signal comes in, boom, goes through this log, down, boom, into the circuit input, goes through our circuit, boom, circuit output, up into this log, which is then connected to this log internally, boom, down, out, gives us our effect. And then obviously when the foot switch is pressed, it then connects these two lugs together, that one there and that one there, which then gives us a LED indicator light. Back to me in the studio. So that's that all wired up. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying these little build videos. Uh, hopefully that was a nice quick video. Knowing my luck, it won't have been that quick. But hey, mm, swings and roundabouts, swings and roundabouts. Um, yeah, like I said, the beginning if you did enjoy this uh please subscribe because you know even though we just wired up a foot switch um you know a three pole double throw foot switch it was still something that i i, I love doing and i hope you enjoyed it as well um and i hope it helps you on your pedal building journey or repair journey whichever it is all right thank you very much for watching if you made it to the end you're part of the elusive five percent club Thank you very much. Um, you will find here and here um, videos and playlists. So please go check them out. Um, thank you very much for watching this video. Goodbye now.